I have one operational state. Request immediate assistance. Over. What might look like a computer game is actually the simulation of the first platoon or Red One under a fierce attack of enemy forces. 500 meters. In this platoon, on the way. just lost all four of their tanks. My first tank to my left, it was a uh, not a mobility kill, but it was a fire kill, so they couldn't shoot their tank, but they could still move. So I wanted to move them behind the other three tanks. But before I did that, I was like, maybe I can move all four of us out of here. For the first time, students of the Armor Officer Leader Course, or A. Bolick, were tested on their leadership skills during a cognitive assessment inside a tank simulator. The lieutenants had to demonstrate how quickly they can make a decision and memorize numeric combinations under a lot of pressure. What appears to be very bad on screen, the course instructors expect it to happen. It's never going to look good on the screens. And that's the intent, you know. They're set up to where if things are going too well, we're going to make sure that we inject stuff that's going to make it a little more hectic. It can be quite a challenge when you have to listen to multiple people. Red one, this is black six. And delegate them at the same time. I was more hectic on the headset than I thought it was going to be because I heard about 10 people talking, so you know, half of them talking to me, so I'm trying to make sure I respond to everybody. 1,300 meters. Uh, what, what, did you, what did you say you seen? Dust trail, 1,300 meters, right, moving right, 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 right to left across our front. So that got a little bit overwhelming at times. Uh, but now we're back up. This exercise is very important to help shape our leaders because... As with the rest of the Maneuver Center, we're focusing on developing, you know, fast, precise, and lethal leaders. So. We do a very good job on developing the lethal and the precise through the range, through the gunnery portion, learning their vehicles. Where we were kind of looking to add to was the fast. So what we decided would make fast leaders and what helps make fast leaders is developing leaders who can make decisions quickly. And quickly, all four tanks were eliminated by the enemy. It would have been a bad day if it was a combat situation. I think in a combat situation, if this is my first time, I think I would have been quicker to retrograde. Um, I think. I wanted to stay and fight as much as possible here in this situation. That's why Abolic trains future leaders how to be faster and smarter before they go on deployments so they can make better decisions on the battlefield. Can you hear me? Cops are down! I, I can't shoot. Like my gun, the gun is done. Heat loaded. Hey driver! Jessica Taylor. Guns broke. Fort Benning, Georgia.